All right, um, all I seem to be hearing lately is power bank this, power bank that. You don't need a power bank. Um, you have yourself a useless thing like a torch in your toolkit. Just use that. Pretty simple. Torch, one of these $1.50 um, cigarette lighter USB adapters. Um, you got an input, input voltage, uh, 12 to 24 volts. Battery packs, 18 20 volts. Does it easy. Just a little switch, you can turn it off and on. Alright, first thing you'll need tamp proof torx bits. Just pull the thing apart. to your battery but you got this metal thing that's in the way um, if you're using a different brand Makita or any of them you probably won't have that it won't be an issue for you you need to know what polarity your battery is with the old DeWalt the positive is the one towards the front of the tool uh, just chuck a screw back in the uh, base to hold it together Take your drill with a hole saw, I've got a, what have I got, 22 mil or 7 8 something like that. And just, you know where all your stuff is inside, so just go easy. And just drill a hole into the... Straight in there, like that. Open it back up again. Just poke a hole through here. to uh, make a square hole for that little switch. So you've got that switch installed there inside of the thing. Just need a little bit of wire. Alright, so tin all your wires, tin all your contacts you're going to solder. Once you've got it uh, tinned up there, just add some heat, bring your two tin things together. Right, so you got it all soldered up and uh, everything. So uh, now you just want to make sure nothing's contacting anything in there that it's not meant to. Then we're just going to use hot glue. I was going to use sick flex, but it's gone off in the tube. You just pound it so you're basically insulating everything so when it does move, it doesn't uh, contact into something that it's not meant to. Push back together. Very good time to um, plug the battery. Just see how she goes. Plug it in. There we go. Click the switch. Yep. Charging the battery. Good stuff. That's how you can uh, save yourself money on a power bank. Yeah got the new tools, some of them have got 5 amp batteries you'd be paying a lot of money for a power bank off the shelf, 5 amps you got the batteries, make your own, 2 bucks about 20 minutes at the most thanks for watching if you can be bothered, watch some of the other videos